morning guys we made it back out to the lake this morning we're gonna do a little more dock shooting today we're out here trying to snag us another one of them tag crappie if we can uh, guys i'm gonna be fishing with the fluger monarch this particular rod here is a five foot six ultra light action guys i like it with four pound test and a 30 second ounce jig head i can get all the way to the back of the dock guys we're gonna be throwing the jig and twitch blue ice pretty much all day coated with that Mena candy thump gel. It works. Yeah, like I said, I like the ultra light rod, five six. That's just all preference. Oh, Christian likes to fish with a little heavier. She fishes with a five foot light action rod. She seems to flip a little better with it. So, you guys, y'all stay with us. See if we can't get on some. Hey, it's fish on. First one of the morning. Feels like a good one too. Oh, it is a big one. No, I ain't got the net ready. Good fish, guys. started <clears throat> uh oh Kristen hooked up I went to get into Good fish, guys. Christian got a good one too. First two casts. Can't beat that, can you? No. I could get it out. It's double hooked on me. Hope that guy's got it. Oh, two yeah. Double that. First two casts. My first cast, here's the first cast. Both hooked up with good ones. Not bad. I usually get hung right here. <laughs> yeah, the water level's up. From what it's been. Oh, yeah. Wow. It'll be a good day. Yeah, it's there. It's a good one. Good one. Yeah, it's good. Yeah, we couldn't ask for a better morning to come fishing. We got just a little wind. It's cool. Here at the start of April, good cool morning. I think it was like 32 degrees, but it's supposed to get up to like 77 today. I believe it's going to be a good day. Hey, it's old. Back at stuck. Yeah, they got. This dock here's got Christmas trees on about every pole. <clears throat> it's kind of a more shallow dock. It probably ain't six foot deep.
good for springtime dock shooting. There he is, fish on. It's a white crappie. Oh no, he came off right there at the boat. I think I had a real good hook in it. Dang. That one was going to be just a little short, I believe, anyway, but I would have still liked to get him in. They seem to be pretty deep, though, ain't they? Yeah. I'll let that one fall a good bit. I only thing with letting it fall on this dock, you'll get stuck a lot. Yeah, that mine ain't no good, man. I flipped it over, rehooked it. Yeah, there's some blue ice in that <clears throat> tackle box. Should be. Is this it? Yeah. I think I moved them because I had too many. Oh, there he is. That would be a lot. Oh, that's a good one. That's a big fish. Big and gas. Yes. That's a big one. Yeah, come on. Oh, it's a slab. Stay off that pole. Uh -huh. Yeah, and come out of the water like a bass. That's so crazy. I had not <laughs> do that last week. Oh yeah, that's the biggest one of the day so far. That's probably a 13 incher I'd say. Good one. Smoked it. Hey, you got them needle nose? Yep. That one's so deep. He choked that one down. <clears throat> Boy, it is. Ah. Come on, now. Work with me here. There we go. Yeah, there's a stud right there. Big hog. There he is, outside the dock. <laughs> That's gonna be a short one, I believe. He wasn't under the dock, though. Absolutely smoked it though. that and grow, let it get a little bigger. And guys, we've been wanting to get out and do a trolling video. I've brought my trolling set up past few times, but we wind up getting on them on the docks, and I'd rather catch them under the docks. Just my opinion. What about you, Christian? Yeah. I love shooting docks. Trolling's fun if you can find them. Yeah, if it's just real busy and you get on them hard, it's fun. It's definitely an effective way of catching them. 
There ain't nothing like this dock shooting. There he is. What a little bitty, and that's a trophy right there now. Wall hanger. There's no catching all your fish. This is supposed to be yours right here. That'd be good in a couple of years. <laughs> What's the water temperature right now? 60. 60 degrees. <clears throat> Should be prime time, you know. There he is, fish on. Okay. I can't tell. No, little one. It's going to be a short one. Good healthy fish. Going to be a good one. Chunk that in back and let it get a little bigger. Was that one deep or he's pretty shallow? Deep, but it was almost deep. at the bottom and he caught it on the floor. Yeah, it was a big one. Oh, slab. I see my line jump. It's the only way I felt it. There he is. Oh, yeah. He was just kind of toting it, and that's a big one. He was bringing it back to you, wasn't he? That's a good one. Yeah. It's going to be a close one. Uh, we're gonna let that one go now. Ain't near as big as Christmas. Christmas like covered us up with some thump gel. Does thump gel work, Christmas? It works. It works. Put it on my tail, it'll be falling that tail all the way down my <laughs> It stays on there good too, yeah, is what I like that about it. Pretty good.
Oh, where he is? Fish at home. That's a good night. I think so. Good fish. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Good. Maybe you can flip that in there. Oh, yeah. Good solid one, though. Not bad. No. Kirsten said the minnow candy does work. It does. There's cast on it, wasn't it? to slam I barely got him hooked. Ooh, barely got him hooked. Oh your line's gonna be stuck. Good fish guys. Good fish. I hope Chris and Miss one. Oh, yeah, that's going to be Hello. another good one for the live wheel. Good thick fish. Oh, 
Yeah. No. See my line move. They're barely hitting it. Weird. Barely even pick it up. There we go. That can hit a little harder. Maybe that's a little better. A little better fish. Gonna be close. Nah, I got him. I gotta get hook him. Yep, gonna be close. See anyway. Maybe it'll go. Oh yeah. Double team. There he is. Fish on. Oh, that's another good one too, I believe. Another Very good fish. Good oh yeah, no luck. Good one. Oh no. That's crazy. What? That's it. Oh, that's a boat. Lost a good one at the boat. It was fighting harder than what I thought though, but I believe it was going to be a keeper, don't you? Yeah. <laughs> Chartreuse juice. with a little bit of this chartreuse juice here. Fish on. That's a better fish. 
I got it over here. That's a good one though. Good fish. Thumping. That's a good one. Got the fire. Battery down. That's fine. Yeah, there's another big slab. Probably a good 13 inch or that's a nice one. Alright guys, we made it back home from the lake. We wound up picking up 10 or 12 pretty good ones to bring home and cook up and clean. Yeah, we caught some pretty decent fish today. Uh, caught a ton of short fish. We did wind up, like I said, bring home. 10 or 12 we're going to clean. Yeah, you know, we're just going to we'll show you how we get from that to a good looking slab. The way we like to do it anyway. But uh, take my electric knife, come right here behind the wheel, pull her down until you feel the backbone. You're just going to follow that backbone all the way down to the tail. Don't cut all the way through, leave it a little bit so to hold on to it. Cut your rib cage out. That's how we like to fill them, guys. We'll catch y'all on the skillet. All right, everybody. We're back in the kitchen with another cooking video for you guys. I'm going to cook up some crappie and a few sides that we have from the night before. Also, some fries. I'm going to go ahead and get those started. They take longer, so we'll get that first. have my flour, cup of flour, cup of cornmeal, mix, salt and pepper, and today we're going to use slap your mama sauce. It's amazing. You can use whatever you got. Let's get these crappie battered up and fried for you guys. Put it in a couple at a time. If they're real big. I'd only do a few at a time. I usually use milk and eggs. It coats it a little better. You don't have to. Just gonna do it a simple way today. I use a bag so it's a lot easier to shake it instead of being all over your hands and less dishes to wash. Smells good already.
making mess. And all the kids are home, so if y'all hear a racket in the background, you probably hear one or two of them. Another thing, if you don't um, like using vegetable oil or anything like that that you usually use, I keep bacon grease, so that also adds to the flavor. Makes it awesome, actually. Y'all try that out. If y'all like these videos and want me to keep doing them, uh, please like and comment on this video so I can make y'all some more cooking videos. I, we do a lot more than just fish. This is just one of our favorite things, so I'll try to show an easy way to get it done and cook fast. Let's throw a few on here. Really good. Just wait till they're golden crispy. Then you can take them off. They don't take very long to cook crappie. That's all the batter. I'm gonna get my mess cleaned up. Let the cook crappie cook a few. And get back to it in just a second. A few more minutes and that will be finished and ready to be on the plate. We got over here fries. I used to use oil to fry my fries, but since I've got an air fryer, there's no better way. They're crispy. I just love the way it tastes. Not a lot about it. Also, we've got getting my stuff out the way. We got some coleslaw that I made last night. We got some potato salad left over. It's really good. Let's let this finish, guys. All right, so our crappie is almost finished. Our fries are done, so we're gonna take this out and get them all put on a plate, and they are crispy. This bless them. These are checker fries. My kids love checkers. They're awesome. The taste, the texture is crunchy, even in the air fryer. All right, let's get this crappie off. I don't really have a heavy coating today because I didn't do the eggs and the milk. I like to change it up a lot um, so the kids don't get tired of what we're eating every night. <coughs> Uh, I like to add also, you can do um, in the oven if you don't like it to fry, you know, health wise or whatever. You can use butter and obey and bake it in the oven for like 20 25 minutes until it's you think it's finished, however bigger the crappie is or what you think. Um, butter and obey is really good. We use it for shrimp. My kids love shrimp too, and it's really, really, really good. I can do some more videos if y'all recommend anything that you like to see me cook. Y'all let me know and we'll try it out. Oh, don't do it. Try to finish getting all this crappie off. And we'll make us the plates. This is about to be amazing. Put that away. All right. y'all we have potato salad mustard potato salad is the best I think a lot of people prefer it different no pickles no onions I like it all all right I also got some homemade coleslaw that I made it is really good so we're gonna get that too And 
and get me some nice fillets. Oh, it's hot. Mm. All right, guys. That is it. And everything looks good. About to mess this up. Guys, please leave some likes and comments. If you like these videos, hit that thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you are not. It really helps our channel out. Appreciate you guys for watching. Till next time, y'all have a good time and keep on fishing.